Hey guys, welcome to this channel and we are on to how to fix PLDT no internet. Okay. First question that we need to ask ourselves is the modem on? That's the first question because if the Wi Fi modem is not on or not plugged in, it definitely will not be able to give your um, devices any internet connection. Second, make sure all the lights are green and no red light blinking or LOS blinking. Okay, and if all of that two questions have been answered correctly and they're all checked and still you still find out that you have no internet connection which will show like so like this one here no internet connection all right so no matter even if you've connected your LAN cable already LAN cable is there this one You've connected that right into the um, LAN1, LAN cable 1, LAN port 1, and still you got no internet connection. Next option you will need to do is restart the modem. To restart your modem, you have to power it off first. Now, sorry about this, I already stick my modem here. You need to press this button here like that and it's off so no more lights blinking and then you have to unplug the modem so this is the plug it's unplugged and then plug it back in and turn it back on again and see all the lights there's any okay let me Turn off my light so that you will see if all the lights are blinking. Okay, let's wait for that. It's resetting. It's taking a while to get started, but yeah, all the lights are coming in now. There are two lights. You will, if the problem persists after this, you will have to do a master reset. Just a heads up. Okay. Now, those lights are green, and they're blinking. It mean, means there's internet connection. And there is internet connection. Okay, well as we can see again here, still got no internet connection. The next option I do is unplug the cable, this cable, the LAN cable because my laptop is connected via LAN cable. So I remove this, okay let's wait for a while before uh, that can connect and then you basically you put it in the first LAN port so there are one two three four you start reading from here one two three four and then you plug it into the LAN one first port that's right there and then let's go back to our PC Okay, let me see. Oh, perfect. It's awesome. There is already an Ethernet cable successfully connected. Let's try and find out and see if we already got internet connection. All right. So there's no internet. Let me see. Let me load up YouTube here. YouTube and 
and let's play some videos to make sure it's connected so a while ago we got this symbol here no internet so we open a new tab open a new tab YouTube maybe you play some videos what is this or okay Steve and Dave use eToro to invest in the financial markets. Steve does research on global investment opportunities. Dave does research on how to become a level 60 wizard. Steve follows the feed for the latest market news. Dave follows the feed for the latest cat videos. Steve has a watch list for Google Chrome not responding. Videos. Sorry about that. Dave has a watch list too. Mr. is Steve. It's because Dave used eToro's copy trader to automatically replicate Steve's trading. Hi, good morning, Sunda. That's the wrong hashtag. Sunda, sorry, request. Okay. Yeah. So there is internet connection. Uh, that's definitely the YouTube. Okay. Or you can open some email also to make sure. Okay. Maybe Facebook. Let me see if that loads up. Yeah, Facebook is there. It doesn't say. And let me load up my admin page for the PLDD. Okay. And password. And right, so we're into the login page. Network security, everything is there. And definitely our internet is working as far as the icon here states Ethernet and once you hover your mouse on it it will show you internet access okay ah uh, yes so okay so that's how you check if you have no internet make sure all the modem is on at least maybe you restart the modem and then after restarting, make sure all the cables are plugged in properly. That's as simple as that. If the problem still persists, you can do master reset. Okay. Now that master reset involves pressing down the reset um, reset button there. There's a reset button like when you see, look at the modem. The reset button is here see the reset you just need to long press and um, get a pin or yeah any any pin that can fit into the hole and just press it down for about five seconds and then release the keys or release the pin and then your your modem your modem for example after pressing it down and releasing those um, the pin after five seconds all these lights will be gone the only light that will be left is this one and your modem is going to come back to its default it's going to come back after five maybe one minute 30 seconds to one minute and then yeah it's reset to default it's it means it's factory reset so whatever password that you have created through this um, website the pldt admin is all going to be reset also so the default password is right at the back of this modem okay i hope you've learned something from this video if you like this video don't forget to subscribe and share this video to everyone and thank you for watching see you guys in my next video